We're on top of this hill um, on the mining site and the mist has rolled in. It's very atmospheric, but it's not very good for geophysics. The problem we've got on the site is that there's no real soil here, so resistance won't really work. Geology is too close to the surface and there's these big piles of um, waste stone from the quarrying. And mag survey won't work because a lot of the geology is very magnetic as well which kind of scuppers us a little bit. So what we've been trying to do is um, a technique called magnetic susceptibility, uh, which looks like it's made of plumbing equipment. It doesn't look very high tech, but it, it can be quite useful. And it only looks at sort of the top four inches of soil or whatever it is that you're going over the top of. So in this case, it's a mixture of the stuff that's been deposited here uh, from the mining process and also this sort of vague soil that's built up over the top. And what we're looking for are hot spots where the susceptibility is higher. And it could be because there's been burning in that area, which might be part of the process of taking the quarried stone and breaking it down to be able to get the ore from it. Or it could be where there's bits of metal left behind as part of the machinery that they would have used. If this doesn't work, I'm not really sure what we're going to try. I think the GPR would only probably map the geology. So we're keeping our fingers crossed for this. Four. Six. Six. Six.